What's up guys, Acid Explosion here, and welcome back to Let's Play Clash of Clans Episode 2. And today, boy, um, I was kind of stupid in realizing that I am, I am not, at, I'm not close to done with Town Hall 3. I mean, think about it, I don't even have my laboratory. So, yeah, I was a little bit, um, stumped about that. Um, I still got this barracks to upgrade to level 5, and, uh... I, instead of just upgrading bo both those two swords, I actually upgraded all four of them because I upgraded the other ones. I figured I don't need to make a video just when I'm upgrading these. But yes, most importantly is this laboratory that I did not even build yet. Like, super, super worried. I'm like, whoa, what am I thinking here? I'm going to be a Town Hall 3 without a laboratory. So we got to buy that laboratory. And then after we buy that laboratory, we still got to upgrade our troops. Also, our mines and collectors. Those are also going to be some upgrades that I'll, we'll probably do off camera just because for sake of time. They only take an hour each. So, I mean, I'll just save time. No need to save up gold for those. So, let's go ahead and attack. This guy, he had a pretty fair amount of loot, 25,500 gold and 25,750 elixir. Um, the only thing I'm a little bit worried about is that mortar in the center there. And it's it's kind of, yeah, it's not very good. I, I should have brought some wall breakers and maybe some goblins because, funny thing, I've never actually used goblins yet on this account. I have them unlocked, but I never actually use them. And in the next attack, I will use goblins. So um, keep that in mind. It's pretty interesting. The next attack, I just have to tell you, is is an insane attack. The the loot's crazy. But enough of that attack. Let's get back into this attack right here, right now. Um, see what I'm doing there? Is I'm trying to break that air defense so that I can break into those level two walls up there, so that I can get those collectors because those collectors w are what i mainly want but as you will see in just a little bit these barbarians do not do what i want them to one shot from that mortar takes them down below half health and another shot and they pretty much all die i wanted them to go for that elixir collector but this last shot from the mortar kills us and we end in defeat sadly with that one elixir collector still left with about 16,000 in it. This raid, this raid is insane. This is what I'm talking about here. It's crazy. Look at that loot. And his mortar is upgrading. So I can just pile down all of my troops right there. And it will just be amazing. Insane massacre. I didn't get three stars, but I didn't lose. I'll tell you that. And I didn't lose in two different ways. I got a ton of loot. And I got 50%. So I won the battle, and I got a crap ton of loot. So, man, just just watch this. My gold right now is already filled up, and my elixir needs only 8,000 more. And it's filling up right now. 49, 50, 51, it's maxed. All those resources are maxed. I feel kind of bad that there was still a lot more left that I could have gotten, but my storages just couldn't hold it. So, by the end of Town Hall 3, I'm not even totally sure how much uh, resources you can hold, but it's got to be, I mean, a fair amount. You have to have enough to upgrade troops. I mean, why would you be able to buy a laboratory and not upgrade troops? So, apparently, we have a lot of stuff in store for us out of Town Hall 3 still that I did not even know about. But that just makes this Let's Play a lot more interesting. So, I just needed to save up my elixir to 25000 to buy that laboratory. And if I had a little extra uh, a little extra left over, I would use it to upgrade that last barracks to level 5. And there we go, our last barbarian had just now died. Crazy amount of loot, way more than my storages can hold. 73,000 gold and 67,000 elixir. Too bad I couldn't actually get it all, but here we are back on the base with full storages. Collectors can't even collect the resources. So, um, yeah, what I'm first going to do here is, is buy that lab because I do not want to miss this laboratory. I, I didn't really put it anywhere. Because I'll put it somewhere later. I just didn't have the time to decide right now. And didn't really care. So before I upgrade this barracks here. I am actually going to use my gold. And upgrade some walls. Because I'm going to upgrade that barracks. But if I upgrade the barracks. What's the point of having all this gold. If I can't upgrade anything else. 
So, yeah. So, I go ahead in here and I just go ahead and upgrade all the walls that I can, which is only 10 walls, to be honest, because they're 5,000 apiece. I can only upgrade 10 walls at a time. That's 6, or no, that's that's 9, and then I just have this one more here on the corner. And that'll about knock us out of all our gold, so we're only sitting at 1,156 gold left. So, uh, not much I can do from there, but just wanted to say, oh, oh, and I almost totally forgot to upgrade this barracks there. I did remember, but I almost barely forgot. There we go. So now we have zero builders, 16,000 elixir, which is still a fair amount, and 1,156 gold. So, I just want to say thank you guys for watching. Peace out. See you on the next upgrade, uh, next episode, and we'll be upgrading more things. <laughs>